Hey, Radians here. I'm looking for a new apartment, but I don't want to waste time checking real estate websites. Hopefully we can code. So let's write a TypeScript program that will run on AWS Lambda every hour, scrap new apartments and send them to a Telegram chat. You can find the code on GitHub. Now let's set up AWS infrastructure with Terraform. We start with an S3 bucket that will store the code for the Lambda. Then we create a DynamoDB table for keeping the state like a list of apartment IDs we have already seen. The Lambda will receive configurations through environment variables. It includes a sentry key for reporting years, a telegram token with a chat ID to send apartments, and the name of the DynamoDB table. To run the Lambda every hour, we'll use the CloudWatch events. At the entry point of our Lambda, we set up a sentry for year handling, and export the handler function. Here we get new real estate and send them to a Telegram chat. We have only one scrapper, but we can expand the app by coding the get new real estate function for other marketplaces. First, we create an instance of state provider. It uses DynamoDB to store the data of a given website and provides two methods. One to get the state and another to update. The state keeps the time step of the last visit and the IDs of apartment we've seen already. Once we have the last visit date, we want to get all unit posted since that time and filter them to skip already shown ones. After that, we update the state and return these units. The website has pagination, so we'll use a recursive function that receives units and the page number. First, we fetch the page, then take the body and send it to the scrapper function. If there are no new apartment, we access the recursion. We scrap the page with the Cheerio library that provides the same API as jQuery. The function takes all the cards and converts them to the unit type is URL, ID and creation date. After we collected new apartments, we want to send them to a Telegram chat. Here we get token and chat ID from environment variables and send each apartment as a new message. That's all, stay productive.